Hello everyone, welcome to Doug Not Games. My name is Doug. How's life, the universe, and everything? Well, here's a new one. Tribe Primitive Builder. We're going to try this one out. Um, I'm not sure where we're at with this one. I guess it kind of depends how this episode goes. Is this going to be a let's try or is this going to be a let's play? It may be a let's play. Um, so, yeah, we'll see how it goes here. This uh, just uh, a, a new one now from uh, just come out on Steam. It's... Uh, Let's see here. Its developer is uh, Space Space Boot Studios, uh, Poly Slash, and another one here, uh, Baked Games, and the publisher is Playway. So um, yeah, we're gonna give it a shot and see how it goes. And I guess how this first playthrough, first episode goes will dictate whether it's a two episode series or whether it's an ongoing series. I do have a slot for an ongoing series right now. So, so let's give it a shot. Uh, all I've done is just made sure that everything works. Uh, so it's going to be an utterly blind playthrough. So first impressions, absolutely. Um, I know that as soon as I click this, we get into a little bit of dialogue. So let's do it. <clears throat> I was a liar. There the we go. Isle of the <laughs> there we go. The unfortunate end of my journey. You'd think that I'm the leader of this quest. Or at the very least, the leader's helper. No. All my life, I thought they were my brothers. But now they will see to my banishment. Fools! They say I deserve this, but they have not had to live with the vision of our doom. Since I was a boy, I constantly played with sticks. I saw their potential and ways to connect them that others thought impossible. The gods were good to me, so our village grew. The elders told me I had a gift, Whew, but the village loud. was not enough. I was convinced that the gods expected more from me. Haunted by the vision of doom, I decided to build an altar that reached the sky. I thought that would appease them, but gods had different plans for me. They split the sky in two and consumed all my work. I was banished for offending them. Me, the only one who knew the truth. Only upon seeing the flaming rocks on the Isle of the Banished up close, the truth revealed itself to me. The gods wanted me to end up here. Uh-huh. Okay. Uh-oh. You got somebody here. You got somebody here who's going to notice you pretty quick. And he's got a knife. Oh, no, he's... Cushman. Hey, another day, another exile. You better prove yourself useful. Come on. Did they exile your mouth too? Can you even talk? I share your tongue. Good. Talk to the chieftain. Elder will see if you are useful or not. Go through the fire cave. You will have to jump from a hanging rock to find our people. You don't jump, you die. Simple as that. Yes, simple. Simple. True. We're not feeding anyone who doesn't contribute, so contribute. This one time I give you fish. Cook them over my fire. You look weak, like a mouse. I don't like mouse. Mouse, scary. 
<laughs> mouse is scary? <laughs> You're scared of a mouse? You have my thanks, stranger. Okay, look at that. Here we are. Well, it looks pretty. I have seen pictures. Talk to the elder. Cook food rations in the campfire and eat food ration. Well, we're going to do that. We're going to do those optional items, too. E. Let's see now. Uh, I want to take... I want to... Okay, food rations. Okay. Cook them all. And then I right-click to use an item. We've got it used. And we're going to do it again. Okay. Let's put you down here. Seven. Drop the left control to split items. Okay. Talk to the elder. That's off in this direction. Okay, we'll do that in a second. Got some things we can pick up. Can we pick up rocks? No, we cannot. Cannot pick up rocks. Oh! Gatherer Mastery 2. See, that was that bush. That Oh, these bushes can go too. And that big leaves, that gets me big leaves. What have we got? Three big leaves and 11 branches. Okay. All right. That requires a tool. Big leaf, keep on turning. <laughs> Gatherer Mastery 3. We're, we're crushing it. Crushing it. Those things we're going to have to use. We need a tool for that. Now, let's just see. Builder, craftsman, woodcutter, gatherer, hunter, and miner. Altar, axe, and hoe. Pickaxe, danger. Okay, tribe, population four, sleeping places four. Okay, don't know what that is specifically. Map, oh wow, that's a very nice looking map. So we're headed over here. Journal. Okay, cook food, yeah. Good, 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 good. All right, let's move on. Can I run? Yes, I can. Run with the shift. Pretty standard fare. Pretty standard fare controls. I don't like the weeble in the walk. But not a big thing. Definitely not a big thing. What do we got over here? Lava. So we're on a volcano. This is probably not the best place to situate yourself. 
but you do have a lot of heat natural heat gathering mastery four okay let's uh, let's see where this leads here oh we need uh, now these rocks I can pick up I see what distinguishes a rock I can pick up against a rock I can't pick up like why can't I pick that one up? <laughs> I probably have limits, so we should probably be careful of that. Uh, doesn't really look like I do, though, does it? Gathering Mastery 5. I am a super master on gathering. Okay. Well, know that there are more rocks back there that you can get if you suddenly decide you need more rocks. Hmm. There's no way back. If I go forward here, there is no way back. Okay. I'm okay with that. I mean, I suppose I could take... Take more stuff than I, maybe I should have. But at least I got what I got. All right. They certainly direct you. Got a couple people here. Ah, gods, giveth yet again. Greetings, fellow exile. By the great birds, you look awful. I have no use for a tired exile. Go drink some water and sleep. Use my tatami for now. Come find me when your body feels stronger. I thank you, wise leader. Okay, let's go get some water. Sleep is up there. Water's over here, I think, is what I would guess. This water does not look good. It looks really bad. <laughs> like, uh, really? <laughs> That looks disgusting. Oh, and I got a mask. Oh, now I've got a little uh, thing up at the top there. Take a nap. So we're going to go take a nap. We will not talk to it. Everything sounds a little wonky. We will sleep for 11 p.m. We'll go there. We'll go for six hours. Talk to the elder. I'm feeling better. I think I'll go for a walk. You're not fooling anyone. Now what do you have to say? You grow stronger by the minute. I see that our little comforts do make a difference. The time has come now, fellow exile. You must build yourself a hut. You can't, you can't keep sleeping on my tatami. You're going to need tools. My workshop is right there. Should you need it, craft the necessary tools there. Everything you need to begin can be found on this island. They do ramble a lot. I'll 
I have. Oh, yes. I thank you. I think I know the answers to those questions. Uh, okay. So let's see. First off, we need to make ourselves an axe. How you doing, buddy? Or girl? I think it's probably a girl, actually. Uh, okay, so this is the old... Yes, we want a crude axe. Uh, but we don't have any vine. So we'll start with a crude knife. And hopefully the crude knife will allow us to cut some vines. Now, can I go back to get vines? Is there, I think there might be some back here. These things? Get as many of this as stuff as we, as we can. Let's go up here and get some more. There's a bunch up here. Gathering mastery. getting too much um, yeah probably okay we'll stop there we've got we've got a fair amount we know where we can get more up here though if we need it now let's build that axe Is there, is there a, I don't think that there's a uh, crude axe, craft that one. Throw that in slot two, crude hammer. Most basic tool to dis disassemble huts. This is a small, okay, disassembling. And then of course we need the crude spear to fight. Okay. We are fully equipped. Find the elder again? Oh, you want me to... I like it when you can click the tool again to dis... to not have it equipped. Hey there, buddy. I see you've crafted yourself some mighty tools. Good. Now it's time for you to build a hut. I need my men well rested. I find them more useful that way. Best find a place beneath sunlight. Quest succeeded. First tools. I accept. Now you will need wood, wood and bamboo. Search outside, follow the path. Should be easy enough. Just look to your right and be vigilant. Start construction of the workshop. Grab resources from the resource, the storage cave resource. Grab resources from the storage cave. The vines grow on on cave exits. You'll find them helpful. Oh boy. If you want to save time, you can check our storage. You'll find excess resources there. There may be enough to help you. The workshop. 
Build the workshop to get access to a rest point, crafting table, and personal storage in the desired location. Press Q to open the building menu. And then the middle mouse button to pin full building costs to HUD. I see. And then left click to pick a hut to build. Okay. Okay. Now, I should probably get a bit more water. And I should also eat a little bit more food. Now, where is this resource? The storage cave, rather. Is it the blue thing? Let's just pop down here just in case. No, I don't think this is it. I think it's got to be out further. Oops. Can't just talk to anybody. Okay. Maybe in here. Looks like there's some stones here. Yeah, there's lots of stones in here. I see. This is the storage. Is this the storage cave? Oh. So, oh, okay. I see. This is the other way around. All right. Good, good, good. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Just a different uh, way forward. No, it doesn't appear as though there's any kind of a... Uh, a stamina meter, eh? I see. And this comes out the top part. Gotcha. over here. Let's just take a little peek at the map. Oh, okay, that's the village storage over there that I'm going to. Let's go over there and see what they've got. I see. Yes, they've got a lot of... Oh, wow. Well, why wouldn't I take all this? Why wouldn't I take as much of this as I could? I don't... I have no idea why I wouldn't. That's it. That's all there is, though. All of these key to the exact same storage. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, why wouldn't I? <laughs> I, I can't even conceive of, of why I wouldn't. Start construction of the workshop. Hey, here's a nice spot right here, hey? Does this make sense? Let's take a little peek here at the map again. Alter village cave village storage let's just uh take a quick boo up here see what we got going
Oh, this looks like maybe this is the altar. Anyway, okay. Okay, well, I think it's maybe not just a coincidence that that's right next to the vill the storage. What the heck is this? Um, now, if I could take this down. Let's see. Salvage. Use the hammer to recover some of the resources from ruins or the buildings that you've constructed. Hit the structure with the hammer three times to confirm the destruction before destroying. Empty the chest and unassign the workers. Press to hit with the hammer. That's it. Yeah, I don't know why I wouldn't do that. You get a whole bunch of materials from it and uh, yeah, it looks good. So here's the question. Do I want to build here? It seems like it's a good spot. I can't see why not. I cannot see why not. So we're going to we're going to try and private food production various. What does private mean? Oh, there's the workshop right there. Sleep hut, medium sleep hut, big sleep hut. Then we've got food, fisher's hut, hunter's hut, farm hut, cook hut. Production gatherer shaman woodcutter potter stone cutter and then we've got various we've got storage hut marketplace and tool makers hut well if there's a chance to make all that stuff maybe i should think about this a little bit where are we right now so in this direction Well, I'm not going to head off in that direction, I don't think. I'm going to take a little look around because, you know, once you've built it, you've built it. There's not a lot of space here where you can just kind of... Ooh. Wow. A lot of space out here. A lot. Maybe I should make it here. I think I'm going to. I think I'm going to tuck it right in. Right in here. Q. Private. Uh, the building's spirit will turn blue when it's possible to build and the ground is flat enough. Scroll to change the building's rotation, confirm, and Q is to cancel. Uh, let's just uh, see what it looks like the whole way around here first. Okay. That's it. That's where we're going to do it. 
Oh wow, holy cow. <laughs> well, that's a little bit of a weird thing. I've never run across this kind of construction. Uh, that workshop is done and my own place to sleep find the elder okay <laughs> here we are so I can go out this side too which is handy yeah yeah, I like this spot. This, this spot works good for me. Okay, let's go find the elder. It's a little bit of a trip to the elder. That's the only thing that's a little... Uh, is there a space through there? Yes, there is. Look at that. It's a little bit of a journey back to the village, but... And maybe that was stupid. Maybe I should have made it closer. Uh... Hey there, bub. Exile, have you made your hut yet? Indeed, my hut is done. Great, I see the gods find you to their liking. It's time to learn how to feed yourself. Craft a spear, you'll need to catch fish. It's easy enough when you get to know these waters. I accept. Go fish. <laughs> Go fish. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's funny. Uh, maybe not as funny as I thought it was, but it was, it was funny. Okay, let's go down here and see, see if we can figure this out here. We're going to need four. Oh, hunting with a spear. When you spot a fish, seagull or turkey, aim your spear and throw it to get a valuable resource. Press the right mouse button while holding the spear to aim. And then left mouse button, hawk's eye to find, oh, use hawk's eye to find the spear, I see. Oh, you want me to go way over here. Well, I'll go where you suggest. Use Hawk's Eye to find the spear. Well, we're going to do that very thing. Oh, yeah, there you are. Hmm. And then we Hawk's Eye to find the spear. There it is. But I, I don't, I'm not done yet. Hey. Hmm. I 
I guess going in the water is not such a smart idea. Because they're, it just scatters them. Yeah, not a good idea. Go up here. Why are you drinking? That's weird. I guess you gotta watch the symbol, hey? There we go. Okay, that's enough of that for now. Uh, let's go back up here. And up here. Put away the spear. We don't want to threaten anybody. Now we want to cook this stuff. And I already know how to cook it, so. Hey, bub. Exile, you have caught, have you caught some fish yet? I did. Great, just remember to use the great gift of fire and cook them before eating. No problem. The sound of an explosion. Uh-oh. See, this is the problem with... Have you felt that exile? Fire Mountain has grown angry with us. Means that the gods disapprove of our ways. We must make a sacrifice to appease them anew. Go now, find our altar, burn some incense as an offering, show our respect to the gods and hope it makes them happy. Now where do I get incense? On my way. Rituals. Perform rituals at the altar to unlock access to different to blueprints for new buildings and items. Remember to check the cost of the ritual before going to the altar. Press O to open the altar panel. Press left to pick a ritual. Oh, oh yes, okay, I see. Incense, we need incense. And that'll unlock talisman and the bamboo totem. So we need incense. Uh, however, what I want to do first, now can I make, here's a question. Can I make a, like a fire? And if I can, how would I do that? Craft incense. Okay, so first off, we gotta go back to our little hut here. And we've got a little uh, shortcut right through here. Sort of. Not really a shortcut, is it? <laughs> it's still quite a ways. Oh well, here we are. Now, I need to make uh, incense. Incense, I need yellow grass and and herbs but can i not make a fire pit hmm apparently not so we'll go back to town and cook this food because we do need food now first before we do anything That's herbs. Okay, so we've got all the herbs we need, but we're still gonna get more. We're gonna need yellow grass, eh?
Always good to get more of that than you need. Uh, more of anything than you need. Yellow grass. We need three yellow grass. Is that what this is? Probably, hey? Yes, it is. Get lots of it. Okay. Mastery eight. Whoo! We're we're pro at this stuff. Okay, so that's enough of that. We're gonna stop that for now. We're gonna go cook some food. Maybe we can cook food up there. If not, we can go to the cave, I guess. Let's try, let's see what we can do up here. We can cook food. Well, this is pretty straightforward. Uh, let's take that and put it down in seven slot. Okay, now let's make, let's make this stuff. Head back to the homestead here. through the shortcut. Might as well get a little extra of this stuff. We're probably going to need it. Okay. Mastery level nine. Oh my. We are pro incense. Let's make a whole bunch of that. Okay, now we want to go over here, and this is what I suspected. I suspected that this was, was in this direction, actually, and not on the top of that hill back there. Although I actually... Okay, find the entrance to the cave. We found the entrance to the cave. Choose the ritual, press zero. Okay, well, we'll do that in a second here. Get a little closer. Place the incense on the altar and wait for the ritual to complete. Whereabouts is, I guess it's back in here. It's a ways in here, eh? It's quite a ways in here. Holy moly. Okay, press zero, or press zero. We're going to do this one. Place the incense on the altar. Cool. 
Sleeping hut? Sleep hut is unlocked. Inform the elder. Bamboo totem is unlocked. Anything else? Oh yes, a talisman is unlocked. And Fisher's Hut. And that's it. That's it? <laughs> but it's got kind of a a good feel to it, doesn't it? it does to me. It has a good feel to it, this game. Um, we just tried Enshrouded, Enshrouded? I can't remember what the name of it is now. Uh, this might not be the way back, but we're going this way apparently. <laughs> um, what the heck is the name of that one? Uh, let's see what it is. It is... Uh, It is, sorry. Enshrouded, yes, enshrouded. And uh, it had kind of a, it had a very linear feel to it, which is okay for the first two hours of it, but uh, I don't know. It was it was good, but it wasn't quite there yet. Maybe, maybe? I don't know. I could be wrong. Enshrouded, I could be completely wrong on that. But uh, it's how I kind of felt about it. It's close. It's very, very close. And I think it'll be quite good. Uh, you start, it's a little bit more combat -y than this one for sure. Have I gone off? The wrong direction. Uh, can I do this? Nope. Yeah. Oh, I see it. The whole tree I can chop down. Wow, this is quite involved. Big, big logs. Yeah, okay. Yeah, as with Sengoku Dynasty, it's these big logs that you're carrying around that you kind of think, ah. You can't carry that much. What's going on? <laughs> uh, but, okay. It's all good. It is all good. Exile, have you performed the ritual? I did what you asked. I saw something strange. A vision. Fire Mountain was angry. Fire everywhere. Also, strange sign. And a big boat? I feel crazy. Aha! At last, the gods have chosen. You must be our savior. Now listen. We don't have time to tread lightly. You must save our fellow exiles. You must save our tribe. Um, really? You want me to save your whole tribe? If the vision is true, the gods have already forsaken these lands. Tribe needs to grow. Without it, we can't build a boat great enough to save us all. No time to waste. The fire mountain turns more angry by the day. 
Noko Hananda we are Noko Hando we got the hoy the hoy now hoy I love Golela Golela Big tribe will need a lot of food to sustain it build a hut for the fishermen I will do that no time to waste now Gods have sent you here for a reason. Find me when the fisher's hut is done. Let gods light our, your path and go. Place a fisherman's hut on the river. Use the map to find the river. Press M optional. Tribe production. The cost of advanced rituals and special huts is high. Make your tribesmen work for you to collect enough resources and let you focus on management. Deliver tools and food to uh, occupied huts. Press T to open tribes summary. Deliver tools and food to occupied huts. Press T. Oh, yes, yes. Okay, this is the tribe. The population is four. We have four sleeping places. We have zero workers. And we have four idle tribesmen. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, okay. Well, I've probably done a mistake by building so far away. But... Uh, Pick the fisher's hut on the river. Use the map to find the river. Press M, optional. <laughs> M for optional. Okay, we've done it. Now, what I want to do, here's what I want to do. I want to do the, the thing, but I want to do it uh, closer to where I live. Closer to where I built, if that's possible because I'm kind of committed now, unless I move this, and that's a possibility for sure. Or maybe it's not. If I go like this, no, no, three. If I go like that, no, no, I don't think, I don't think it is. Okay, so the river, is right in that direction. So if I come over here, yeah, it's nice and close. It's close, very close. What's that? It's different uh, area. Okay, so I think this is gonna work. Uh, Q, and we're going to go food, and we're going to go fisher's hut. Just like that. That's where I'm going to put it. Uh, leave. I didn't know I even had any bamboo. And another one over here. No resources, so we need more bamboo. Bamboo. We need more bamboo. I wonder if I could build a staircase that goes up here. Because that's going to be a pain in the in the butt to get up and down. But you can go up here. So that'll work. And there's a lot of bamboo right here. Look at this. Handy dandy. Okay. Uh, 
How much bamboo do we have now? Let's go one more. Okay. So yeah, actually I would have liked to have made it right there, but that's not much of a difference. Okay, we got lots of bamboo now. Oopsie. Have I got the right tool selected? Oh, E. Dummy. E. E. It says E right there. You don't want to destroy it. The hammer. And then... And then the far side. No resources. We need yellow grass. Oops, wrong side. This way. There happens to be a whole bunch of yellow grass right here. Handy, handy, handy. See? It was good that I picked up all that yellow grass. I'm getting tired. I'm tired, tired, tired. And this. That should do it, right? Craft a bamboo totem. Finish all building phases. There's another... There's another... Oh, there. No, 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 no! Oh, no, no, no. I've done it. I've done it. I've wrecked something. I have... Ah. Uh, probably shouldn't equip that button. Now what? <laughs> oh no. Okay, well, I'm going to go and sleep because I'm exhausted apparently. I'm very thirsty. I'm very hungry. Ugh. Dehydrated. Drink fresh water from the river. Okay, we'll go, 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 go. Don't worry, we're going, we're going, we're going. I don't know how we're going to fix this thing because I've screwed up. Okay, let's see. Is there some way that I can... Uh, hmm. Oops. No, I don't want to do that anymore. Um, sleep hut. I think I might have done a bad thing here. I might have to just take this all down and build it up again. Wait, wait, wait. Maybe I can now. Maybe now I can build it back up. I probably just should have knocked it back one stage and then we would have been good.
We need more yellow grass. I would have been fine if I had, if I had done it right. So if you do that, you gotta knock it back to a stage where blue items start to show up again, I guess, eh? And then you're okay. We need a bamboo totem. That's, that was the problem. We need a bamboo totem and we can build the bamboo totem in our home building, which is right here. We want a bamboo totem, but we have to get a little bit more. A little bit more uh, bamboo. So they go as a set here, I guess, eh? Okay, that should be plenty, 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 plenty. We're gonna have to bring this episode to a close here. Bamboo Totem, craft it. Okay, now we go over here Boom, Chagalaga. We find the elder. That's pretty good, actually, because you can, you can fish here, you can fish off of here, you can do all kinds of fishing there. All right, let's try and take a shortcut to the elder, if possible. It's possible, it's very possible. That's a quick, that's definitely a quick way to go. Hey there, bud. Greetings, exile. What is new? Well, I'll tell you, the fisher's hut is done. That is good. Time to make the tribesmen work. Take the spirit to the fisher's hut. Take five food rations to the fisher's hut. Assign tribesmen to the fisher's hut. Bring tools, place the torch with the totem. Uh, more, more torches mean more workers. The signal seems simple enough. Also, workers need to eat. Here, have some food rations. Bring them to the fisher's hut. Got it. Food and tools to the fisher's hut. Got it. Okay. Well, I think this is where we shall leave it. At the beginning of the next little, little, uh, uh, quest here or task here take the spear to the fisher's hut take five food we've got five food right now I believe on the character we've got we've got six actually we can take there and we've got a spear we can take there assign a tribesman to the fisher's hut okay well there you go um I think we're going to play this for a bit. So this is not going to be a let's try. It's going to be a let's play. And we'll get as far as we can in it. And uh, we'll see how it goes. It's, uh, yeah, it's very interesting. 
It's kind of a little bit Sengoku dynasty, medieval dynasty, where you're building a little community to... Anyway, yeah, I probably should have built right here, though, instead of way over on the other side. But, uh, yeah, live and learn. We'll see. <laughs> we'll see. Maybe it'll be good. Maybe it'll be bad. But uh, that's where we are for now. But but anyway, we're going to leave it here for now. Thanks for watching. If you're considering watching another, please click the I like this button. Uh, leave a comment. Are you playing this? Do you have plans to play this? Uh, and uh, what the heck, if you haven't done so already, why not subscribe? And if you have, thank you. I appreciate it. Please share and enjoy. And hopefully I will see you next time in... Uh, this this game maybe hey come back to this game uh this is a uh, tribe primitive builder is the name of this game uh so join me again for the next the next episode we will see you next time so long <laughs>